journal entry number two, Iguanodon. But first, what three places do you think Iguanodon fossils were discovered? I will tell you at the end of the video. Moving on. Iguanodon was a herbivorous dinosaur that lived during the early Cretaceous era. The name Iguanodon means iguana tooth in Greek, and its name is because the teeth resemble those of the iguana. The Iguanodon could also grow up to be very big, being up to around 9 feet or 2.7 meters tall, which is taller than most school buses, and could weigh up to 3.5 tons or 3.1 metric tons, which is about as much as a van. For being such a gigantic dinosaur, the Iguanodon was only as smart as modern day crocodiles. But because the Iguanodon was such a giant hunk of meat, it was preyed upon by predators such as Carnotaurus, Allosaurus, and Tyrannosaurus rex. And it couldn't just call the Triceracops, so the Iguanodon had to defend itself, and it did this in the form of a huge claw on the end of its thumb. However, sometimes defending itself would prove too difficult, and so it had to run away. But this beast could only reach top speeds of around 15 miles per hour, or 24 kilometers per hour. Which means the average elephant could outrun this dinosaur going at 25 miles per hour or 40 kilometers per hour. The Iguanodon also had the ability to walk on two or all four of its legs if it so pleased. And it could accomplish this with the help of its tail and powerful legs, which were stiff and not very flexible. This mighty animal was also one of the first discovered dinosaurs ever and has helped us understand more about dinosaurs and how life was so long ago. Now time for some quick facts about Iguanodon. Iguanodon was discovered in 1882 by Mary Ann Mintel. Iguanodon was one of three creatures used by Sir Richard Owen to coin the term dinosaur. Back then, Iguanodon was believed to have a horn on its nose, which was actually the thumb claw. Iguanodon was once believed to have been a giant iguana-like creature. The so-called creature would have looked like a huge lizard that walked on all fours. Now knowing all this knowledge, I will rank Iguanodon in B tier for being such a strong animal and mainly because it was able to defend itself from some predators. And the answer for the question in the beginning of the video is Europe, North Africa, and North America. So if you liked the video, make sure to like and subscribe so I can take you on another adventure and document my findings in the Jurassic Journal. See you next time.